Teddy. Teddy is a story about a stuffed bear learning to love his flaws and to know his self-worth. In a big city, there was a small toy shop. The toy shop was filled with all sorts of things like springs, games, rubber ducks, and stuffed animals. There was a bear, rabbit, frog, and an elephant. The bear's name was Teddy. Teddy was brown and very soft, but none of the kids ever picked him to come home. You see, Teddy had a big orange paint stain from when he tried to paint a flower, so none of the kids ever picked him. Teddy wasn't sad though. He had his friends to play with once all the kids left for the day. Rabbit would run super fast to get a game to play. Frog would hop up to the top shelf to get the candy. Teddy made sure to turn off the bright lights and turn on the pretty star lights, all while Elephant would start to play fun songs. Each night they would play in dim lights, laughing, eating candy, and sometimes they would even dance. One day though, a little boy walked in and immediately looked at Elephant. He looked so happy and asked his parents, can I get this one, please? With that, Elephant had made a new friend and had to go to his new home. On the next day, it rained. It rained until a girl with a green raincoat ran in. Unlike the boy, she walked around until she saw the frog and her eyes lit up like stars. She hugged him tightly and wouldn't put him down. Soon after, Frog had gone home with his new friend too. That night, Rabbit and Teddy sat with the lights that seemed darker today, playing a game with no music and a little hungry with no candy. One day, on a warm morning, a little girl came in with cute overalls. She played with Rabbit until the sun started to set. As the sun went down, the girl left with her new toy, Rabbit. Rabbit could not stay on the shelf with Teddy anymore. Teddy sat alone in the dark as the starlights no longer lit up. Teddy felt alone and missed his friends so much. He wished he could have a new friend and go home too, but none of the kids wanted him. Teddy started to cry and he didn't stop. He didn't even stop when the sun came up. It was time to open the store when the owner heard a quiet cry and went to see where it was coming from. The owner followed the sound until he found Teddy. The owner asked him, Teddy, what happened? Why are you crying? Teddy cried out, all my friends are gone. I can't even make new friends because they think I'm ugly with my orange stain. Teddy, they don't think you're ugly, the store owner said in a soft voice. You just haven't found a friend that is as caring, loving, and special as you. You are perfect, stain and all. One day, someone will, someone will notice that and you won't ever feel lonely again. With that, the store owner wiped Teddy's tears, put him back on his shelf, and gave him a lollipop. The store owner left to continue opening the store. Teddy thought about what he was told and decided he was perfect. He had just decided to wait patiently for someone to be his friend when suddenly a girl with, a, a, with an orange cast and an orange dress walked in. Once she saw Teddy who has an orange spot, she couldn't look away. She instantly bought, brought Teddy to the cash register and bought him. As they were both walking out, Teddy smiled and waved goodbye to the store owner. The end.